How's everyone doing? Yeah. Um, I work in a warehouse, which it's not a weird job, but there are a lot of weird jobs out there that really just shouldn't exist. There's like the guy who holds signs, and not like the Chick Fil A guy, like a mascot, but just the guy outside in street clothes that holds the "We Buy Gold" sign. <laughs> There's no reason for him to be there. Like, what's the interview process for that? He goes in. Uh, do you have a hand? Two. <laughs> You're an overachiever. <laughs> <laughs> like, hey, hey, hey. Can you hold this sign? <laughs> yes, sir. You got spunk, kid. You're gonna go far. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, do they realize they're doing the job of a stick? <laughs> really, take a stick, fashion the sign to it in some form, put it in the ground, do the exact same thing. I know what you're thinking, Nathan. You have really, really simplified the art of commercial sign holding. But I've been around the block, guys. I've seen it done. <laughs> I've done it. I've taken signs, attached them to sticks, and put them in the ground. They were great. <laughs> I always wonder if anybody ever got fired. <laughs> That's a fun conversation when you get home. Oh, hey, how are you today? I got fired. <laughs> and what happened? They bought a stick. That's <laughs> 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 my sign to it. Sticks don't care when it rains. <laughs> but on the flip side, I wonder if there's like really good sign holders. Like, this guy's out there, you know, he's got his gold sign, you know, people are just going in, they just want their gold. You know, look at this guy. His limousine pulls up, window goes down, his hand with a business card comes out. Hey kid, you ever want to really hold signs? Come talk to me. <laughs> you know, it's like a goodwill hunting situation where they just put the sign on the ground and just walks up. <laughs> People just watching, that's him. We got it. <laughs> if I could have any job in the world, it would be a weatherman. And a weatherman because you don't have to be right. Like, there's no other job where you can just guess, be wrong, and oh well, <laughs> it's still gonna rain. You know, you can't be like Johnson, your predictions were one million dollars over what you did. So sorry. Nah, it's okay. <laughs> You're fine, keep going. But if I had to be a weatherman, it would only be in Georgia. Because they're never right. <laughs> and I think that what I would do is I would predict snow every time it got cold. I don't even care if there's one cloud in Tennessee, I'd predict snow. Because people go nuts. And it's so much fun. <laughs> Weathermen, they get up there and they think they're so great. You know, storm smith, meteorologists. They should be called guesser. That should be their name, Chief Guesser Storm Smith. He gets up there, he's got his green screen, they've you know, got the little U.S., they think they got the world in hand. They don't. They use all these weathering lingo, you know, well, you see the jet stream, it's going to push the system south, it's going to bring in a cold front and move up, as you can see. They always say that to you, as you can see, as if we're following along at home going, oh yeah, <laughs> I can see that. <laughs> I was just about to say that before he did. Like, as I can see, it's going to be cold. <laughs> but I think I would predict snow, you know, I'd stand up there and I have my suit on, probably no pants, I don't know. <laughs> and then I'm going to be like, as you can see, we're going to snow. There's going to be snow. I wouldn't even use units of measurement, just a lot of snow. Piles of it in various locations. <laughs> go nuts. I just like pick up just a cat and just sit on my lap and just uh, uh, uh. <laughs> go over the live feed of 85 and just watch it. <laughs> the car is abandoned, you know, school bus on fire, children running from it screaming. An old man beating a woman to death for the last loaf of bread. <laughs> it's all mine. My creation. My anarchy. That is why I don't listen to your weatherman. Just go outside. If it's cold, come on, sweater. If it looks like rain, just. Um, that's all I've got. My name's Nathan.